So basically now I'm just putting some cool colours around the actual um, and I don't mind it going into the hat even though it's going to be a pink colour. Right back there. But it drops. It actually. Right, just lifting some colour out here now. Just using a clean brush to make sure I preserve some of these whiskers. The shirt's quite dirty down there. I'm going to put a lot of darks in here later. You could use. I'm not saying this is the all you could use, but and a bit of cobalt blue. So there's lots of choices you could use. Lost that one, I'll have to scratch it out a bit. Soften because you don't want these lines to look too hard. And it's cool a question of just and just come back to it in a sec. Well, it's a little bit more. sort of like use this darker background to show off the beard a little bit here so I'm just basically putting that in to have the finished painting you can see um, you know we use quite a simple palette really we just use burnt sienna cabin red um, a little bit of yellow ochre um, we used a cool wash for the eyes um, yeah but in the background here we just used um, Ultramarine with a little bit of burnt umber, a little bit of splattering again. But the main colours for the face, which was I guess the most important in this, um, were uh, burnt sienna.